But another celebrity friend of mine like called me one day and he's like, hey, I'd like you to meet one of my friends. And I was like, okay, cool. And I was like, it's probably his little sister. Like he probably wants me to say hi to his little sister or his niece or something. Yeah. And then he gives the phone to his friend and he goes, Hey, David, it's Leonardo DiCaprio. And I go, what the fuck? <laughs> and I'm like, hi. And and as, and as then he like, and then he, he starts talking to me about something. And like, I put myself on mute and I run into the office. And Jay, I think you were there. Yeah. Yeah. And I run into the office and there's yeah. like three or four of you there. This was months ago. This is like a year ago, maybe. Yeah. And I run into the office and as, as he's talking, I go, Leo DiCaprio is on the fucking phone with yeah. me. And Jason goes, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then we're just listening to Leo talk for like two seconds and then bring it back because i didn't want to like be weird and sitting around this campfire of leo's voice <laughs> um yeah and then um and then i and then i saw him at a party yeah um like uh, a couple months later and i and i was like fuck it i'm gonna walk up to him and i walked up to him i said hello he fucking said hello to me i was like what the fuck this is crazy this dude knows who i am like i get to walk up to fucking dicaprio <laughs> and then fast forward a couple months um we want to do something around voting um and i thought this was like a perfect thing to do like some sort of like giveaway aspect where you can meet leo because i think that'd be the coolest fucking thing um and we got it done and natalie and i went over there the other day we went to go take the picture <laughs> and we were so fucking nervous <laughs> the uh, whole were, ride there yeah, and david like and a, i were like oh my god like, like just like when like i a, get nervous it, i start being like ooh, like i start yeah. singing weird it was shit. like a 40 minute car car <laughs> so ride funny. and like and, at, 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 yeah at some point at one point natalie was like i just don't get the whole space thing like i'm really oh, thinking, yeah, and, I, and I literally went nelly shut the fuck up shut the fuck up we're going to see the biggest fucking celebrity in the entire world and i just shut the fuck up i was so stressed out i was so scared and natalie was like right right i'm sorry like we were all on the same page about how scary it was and we were just like we were like and the best part is when you're when you're i've done this with like 30 different celebrities that i've gone to visit like every time i'm going to drive up to one i'm like imagine like imagine he goes hey we're going to peru right now you want to get on our yacht yeah. and like i run through all these stories on like how this can possibly go and I, I was telling Natalie I'm like I can't leave the country because I'm DACA but I was like Natalie if he like fucking asks us to go to like fucking uh, you know Belize right now or like <laughs> fucking we, we should go right we'll get on the plane we'll deal with the immigration stuff later <laughs> and, and Natalie was like I mean yeah I guess yeah if Leo asked like we should leave the country and like we were going through all these fucking scenarios in our head we we're like yeah, yeah yeah and it was just like we were so fucking nervous and then we got there and it was like Dude, it's just like it's it's crazy. Like when that like the second you get to hang out with the celebrity and that like that wall breaks or like that tension breaks, like he opened the door for us and his dog got out. Yeah. And so he had to go chase his dog. <laughs> <laughs> like, like and that's where you go, oh my god, yeah. this is fucking He's real. It's the guy from the Titanic yeah. and this is the Wolf of Wall Street, but <laughs> He's fucking, he's here at his house, just fucking chilling. Like, and he's the fucking nicest guy. He's so nice. Yeah. He's when we when we first pulled up, we heard like kids run, like screaming from like the house, like yelling or playing or whatever. And we we're like, uh, are we at the right house? Cause we like just didn't anticipate that. Yeah. And like, he had like family over and like a bunch of little kids. Yeah, was, the dogs were out. Like it was a whole, like, yeah, it was just like, expected, but it, it was, was just so crazy. And we were just like, I can't believe we're just like the guy that's fucking in Titanic, Jen Django Unchained, the Revenant, Wolf of Wall Street, like fucking <laughs> yeah. Inception. Where just fucking right here just hanging out with him it was so bizarre and he was i don't know i i i'm i'm not just bullshitting but he was just so nice and his girlfriend was so sweet was he joking around with you and stuff mm -hmm. yeah he was really because cool, we were trying to take this fucking picture and we were so bad at it because we couldn't find the right lighting because right. there were shadows everywhere because it was like the worst time and we just we went all around the house trying to take this picture and then we ended up at the same spot where we first took the picture um no it was really fun he's it was the best so i'm glad i got to do that um and a lot of people well, it's it's actually the campaign's doing really well, so it's exciting. Obviously, it's fucking Leo. Are you doing Inception two with him, or? Yeah, I'm actually. Yeah, I'm doing. I'm going to do the Revenant two. I'm okay, the bear. Doing, is that why you have a beard? <laughs> yeah, I'm growing out my beard. I can to, see it's really big now. To play the beard, got big quick. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. <laughs> That's crazy. So you're gonna have to like go and live in the woods for a while. For eight months, eight months, yeah. They want me to get there four months ahead of time. Just so four can, months before the crew. Four months before the yeah. crew, just to kind of figure it out on my own. You think you could do something like that? Uh, the movie like The Revenant? Yeah. Fuck no. You don't think so? Fuck no. If someone said to you, David, we're going to give you this Oscar winning script. All we need you to do is like gain, you know, 100 pounds and live in the woods. Oh, the, well, yeah. I Did mean, you do I, that? Did you go method on it? Yeah. If it's like an Oscar award, like if I know it's going to win an Oscar. Yeah. Fuck yeah. And if they're confident that my involvement in it would also like do it justice, then yeah. 100%. Like I'll live wherever. Like for like to make anything entertaining, I would fucking do anything. Um, but like, I just don't think I would do a movie justice, especially of where I'm in the wilderness for <laughs> eight months. Oh yeah, you don't sure. like nature. Yeah. <laughs>
But yeah, it is what it is. Did Leo ask about your friend Tom? <laughs>